London. Today, Barney's in London to meet Lola and her owner, Mark. Lola is trained to sniff out bed bugs, which are small parasitic insects that live by feeding on human blood. Blech. Lola's two years old and she's the only certified bed bug dog in the UK. Barney, it's time for you to meet Lola. All right, Barney, calm down. There's work to do. OK, that's enough playing. Come on, Lola. Time to go to work. Let's show Barney what you can do. Come, Barney, you're going to come in? This is what a bed bug looks like close up, but they're actually about the size of an apple pip. There's no evidence to suggest that they spread disease, but they do leave an itchy bite. But don't worry, if you did have any in your house, you'd probably already know about it. Right, Barney, Lola's here today to search this hotel room, uh, and we're looking to see if there's any bed bugs here. Come on then, Lola, find your bees. Find your bees, that's the command for her to start searching. She's sniffing all the areas, trying to detect any scent, and if she finds anything, she'll get closer and she'll give us a pouring motion if she comes in contact with anything. And so far, she's sniffing everything she can, taking it in to see if it matches a picture that she has in her mind for bed bugs. Oh, that's just finished. Well, no bed bugs in the room. Did you get that, Barney? Well done, Lola. Well done. Now let's see what Lola does when there are bed bugs in the room. What we've got here is two bed bug vials. Both of them have got bed bugs in them. Uh, I'm going to go and hide them in this two different places in this room, and then we're going to bring Lola in, and we're going to see if she can find them. Come on, let's go. Find your bees. Find your bees. To the ugly bug ball. To the ball. To the ball. Good girl. Good girl. Now, I'm going to reward her because she's just alerted. What we call alert is that scratching motion. A bed bug can live in hibernation for up to a year. Find your bees. And they can take in up to seven times their own weight in blood. Hope you're concentrating, Barney. It's going to be your turn to do some training next. Good girl! Good girl! Two out of two. That's what we expect of a clever bed bug dog. The ugly bug ball. Now it's Barney's turn. Instead of using bed bugs, we're using dog biscuits, treats for Barney to find. These are the sort of things I did with Lola before she went to America to, to learn to be a, a bed bug dog. We're getting him into the idea of finding things, which is the first step, really, to a dog detecting anything. Well done, Barney. Now we're going to make it a little bit harder. I'm going to hide them. We're going to see if you can find them. There's one under the bed and one by the laptop. Come on, where are they? Where are they? Well done, we found one. There we go. Getting warmer, Barney. Right a bit. You're nearly there. Oh, and he's got the other one as well. Two out of two. That's great. I know you could be a bed bug dog. Well done, Barney. And as long as Lola's around, we know that we can sleep easy in our bug-free beds. And there's plenty more dogs with jobs out there for you to meet, Barney. The ugly bug ball.